And welcome back guys, we're going to be playing some more Cyberpunk 2077, and we're going to be doing the end quests for the game! And then, when the new DLC drops, we'll be able to go straight for the DLCs, hopefully, Cyberpunk 2077 developers will have it set up where anyone that's completed the main storyline can just go right into the DLC, and hopefully that won't make you replay the game to access the DLC. But, there's only one way to find out. I'd rather be ready, and... And I'll not be sitting there trying to finish the game storyline just to be able to access a DLC. I'd rather be ready just in case and over prepared. So let's get into playing some Cyberpunk 2077. Make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe button, let's get into it. Can I see what you got?
God, I feel sick. Don't like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. Can you chill for two sacks? We go in, we talk, we leave. That's it. She emptied the place. Shit. Excellent. You have come. Let's step to it then. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. Weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobud killed your father. No? I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. You knew? But didn't do a thing about it? Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Ties that bind. Yes, family. I was to be its heart, to uphold life, ensure continuity, stability, never to oppose it. Huh? Guess Yorinobu's instructions were a little different? Yorinobu raised his hand against our father. But he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm hmm He's your brother. It's been hard, it'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout, when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yurinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Of course I didn't bring Soul Killer. Afraid we don't know each other that well. You prefer to keep your guard up. Understandable, but unnecessary. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Meaning, Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. Sure know how to prick up my ears. Go on. Talk. My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Hmm. 
Sounds like you want to avenge dead old dad. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama, soro-soro gojitaku ni omodori itadaite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen, mind if I'm straight with you. Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Offers intriguing. Need to think about it. Naturally. But think quickly. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. We're getting the fuck out of here. Are you well? Yeah, it's just, um... You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make your decision. Ah! I'll think it over. You could use some air. Right now. Good to go. Body listens to me. See what I'm getting at? Of course I can see. Want me to hand over the keys? I want to save your life. Pop some pseudo endotrizine. Scooch and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Mikoshi. Uh-huh. Oh, exactly. Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she'd have stuck her neck out for you a half a century ago. But now, I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find the way inside Mikoshi. It's our only chance. What about Pan Am? She offered help. Listen up, V. Those guys are trailer tuggers. An assault on our Asaka's just not another convoy to Jack. You already tried this with amateurs. Both know how that ended. And you... tried it with pros. Didn't end any fucking better. You don't want those people involved. Their lives on the line. Possibly on your conscience. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. Rogue? I don't know. You honestly think it could work? With her experience, her resources, her connections. Won't find anyone better in NC. Johnny... It's gotta work. We breach the tower. All cracks open Makoshi. Then I fuck up that. Great, you checking out again? Just yet. Vic. You're in pain, I know. 
delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. How? How did I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table and demanded you be treated immediately. Talamant was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh, wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. So, <clears throat> how bad we talking? That bad, huh? All right. That should be a little better. Try sitting up, carefully. I'll try. Think I'm getting some feeling back. Sit slowly. Another victory for the history books. Well, looks like I can sit up, all right. But I can tell you don't have good news. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? I know, Vic. I'll try. Soon. No. You'll do it now. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah? What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo-endotrize in there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endotrizine, Rogue Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Enough, Johnny. I just... I gotta think about it. Need to stretch your noodle? Fine. Fine. Just not, just in, not this in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Uh, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. I think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. AV, I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure, lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What, what's he gotta do with any of this? You'll see. Come on.
Top floor. He had the same glum face. Who, oh, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumbas on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but. He found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. Ah, oh, that's more like it. Air. See that? I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Be alone with my thoughts. You're on unachievable these days. So what? What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, you know. Gonna be a legend in this city. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way, just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. Stubborn badge. Mm hmm. Hey, V. Hey. I wake you? Nah. Wasn't asleep. Shipping containers again? Uh, worse. What could be worse than that? Uh, pursuing somebody else's botched case. Hard to explain. Question is, what are you doing up? Might have had a bad dream, too. Kind of like yours. How so? Also lived a double life. Mm. As an overweight detective, his moral backbone made of hot dog buns. Oh, try dead rocker boy with a bloated ego. Sounds nasty. Yep. Trade places with me? Listen, seeing as you're not asleep either, what do you say to Little Nightcap? Can't. Not today. And probably not anytime soon. Everything alright? Yeah, just got something on my mind. You know? Might not have been the best cop in Night City, but I can tell when someone's... Talking out their ass? Not speaking the whole truth. Find yourself in some trouble. Fierce variety. Might have been the trouble that found me. Mm. Well, that might just be what I like most about you. Hey, I gotta go. Wait, wait. Whatever it is, you can count on me, okay? I know. Thanks, River. Hang in there. <sighs> okay. Was good you called. 
Wish I'd had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think, it all started in a fucking landfill. <laughs> then you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. I think you ought to go with Rogue. The two of you together got the best shot. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. You're up, Johnny. I trust you. Take the wheel. Just go easy on us, yeah? Thanks, V. I'll get us through this. You'll see. See you on the other side. That's right. Even if I gotta burn this whole fucking city Look down. who we have here. Hey there, V. Drop in for one last drink before turning in. I'll put it to you this way, Wakako. How Don't you doing? Don't get in my way. You're running your little operation only because I have allowed it. And I can change my mind whenever... I want. Hang on, give me a sec. V? V's taking a break. It's me. We'll talk soon, Wakako. What do you want, Johnny? Jesus, who died? Not happy to see me? Frankly, I'm not sure. Why? We had fun at the movies, didn't we? We're not at the movies anymore. Plus, got a good idea why you're here. You want something. And that's always a bad sign. Of course I do. And who better could I take it to? Out of that whole crazy crew from Atlantis, by some crazy coincidence, only you survived. How's that supposed to mean? Just thinking back. You miss the old times at all, Rogue? Fine with where they are, fine with where I am. I can see that. Shame no one else from the Atlantis had the same luck. Oh, yes, you is. Sheesh, what's the matter? Nothing. Your shift's done. You're heading home to kick your feet up. Okay. Guess I'm gonna go back to work. We'll have the whole place to ourselves? Hmm. VIP treatment. Now talk. Just what the hell are you insinuating? You're wasting I'm my time. Alone behind the bar. Yep, been waiting there. Just, I never knew what the fuck for. But I'm starting to get some good ideas about how I might use it. Chose a cozy life for yourself. I'm just curious what it cost you. We all pay a price for the choices we make. I'm no exception. That what you tell yourself when you're cashing corp checks? That's what I tell myself when I stand over the graves of the crew from the Atlantis. It's what I tell myself when I look at you now. Well, hey. The past is the past. That's right. But that's not why you're here. 
You want to drag me into something again, and this chatter is just a prelude. This body, I'm trying to... I... no. Fuck! V's dying, and I'm the fucking cancer killing her. But the process can be stopped. I just no, have to... Johnny. Don't start. Don't tell yourself you're out to help someone. It's only ever about you, so you can feel better. No, fuck oh. off, princess. I'm running out of time, Rogue. When that fucking clock strikes 12, Johnny will disappear and V will go with him. Need to get myself out of her head before that happens. We managed to contact Alt. She agreed to help. But? Only one place we can do it. The data fort. Mikoshi. And the only access point we got a chance of reaching is tucked snugly under Sokka Tower. Arasaka? Again? Should have seen that coming. Only an idiot does the same thing over and over, while expecting things to work out differently. You even have a plan for this? You're the best fixer in town. You tell me how we're gonna do this. Did you say we? That's right. Can't possibly work without you. So what? I dust off and load up my tsunami? Rejoin your crusade against Arasaka? Bingo. When? Dunno. Now? Hmm. And what makes you think I'd agree? Cause I think you know you only want. Me and everybody else you buried while you climbed to the top. Shit. Knew this would happen one day. That one night, by some fucking miracle, you'd waltz in here and tear everything down. Some things never change. And us? Have we changed? I don't know. Well, what do you say we go find out? Will you lend me a hand? Shut the fuck up, Johnny. Just stop talking. Fucking Christ! <laughs> every time. Every time. Never have I seen one not drunk as a pig sleep over 20 hours. I remember that face. Gotta be Crispin Wayland. Spitting image of your dad. Blood of the blood. Well, what did I miss? Why are you here? The boss will explain all. Rogue? There is only one boss. Let's go. The boss awaits. You said your hellos. Excellent. Rogue, what's this specimen doing here? He's our pilot and our ride to Corpo Plaza today. Our ride. So you're in. Don't act all surprised, leadhead. Gears over there. Help yourself. Don't mind if I do.
What are these? Retro thrusters. anti -grips. Strap them to your legs and you can jump from damn near any height. Christ, honey, I'm not your fucking babysitter. Got it. Okay now. <laughs> 
Gonna tell me what the plan is? Yep. Jack in the shard. Targets the Mikoshi access point in Arasaka Tower. Need to reach the lab floor. Hold it just long enough to do what we need to do, then get out alive. Arasaka Tower's a fortress, the most secure building in Night City. Walking in through the front door just ain't an option. So, we'll get in through a window of our own making. Specifically, we fly in on a Militech Strix tactical bomber. First, we rain fire on the building's air defenses from a high altitude. Then we breach a wall on the 76th floor, jump from the AV, and survive the landing thanks to our anti-grabs. That's right. We'll land smack in the middle of a tropical rainforest. Contrary to popular opinion, Arasaka has panache at times. We cut our way through the jungle to a shaft located on the tower's vertical axis. The shaft runs the height of the building, we use our retro thrusts again. Reach the bottom floor quickly. We'll surprise the socks off security. They'll be in disarray. Resistance should be minimal. We hit the lab floor running, reach the access point. The rest will be in your hands. I'll hold for applause. As I said, there's only one boss, one queen. Saying we're gonna rain fire on these assholes. Seriously? I've waited too long for this. Don't bust out of your pants just yet. If we want to survive, we gotta do a lot more. Here comes the tricky bit. We're gonna knock a Jerujan 0401 ComSat off its orbit. Blood clot satellite! We're gonna make history, friends! That'll freeze comms in NC, NorCal, and SoCal. Should buy us three or four hours. No coordination, no support, Complete chaos. Mean to tell me that apart from that fucking bomber, you have a weaponized space shuttle? Got a certain acquaintance at Orbital Air. Mystery benefactor? Highly positioned informant. I'll pay him enough to give us access to the Jerujan. The rest will be up to our old Netrunner friend. You mean Alt? Only one I know who can rip an Arasaka satellite out of the sky. I'm supposed to talk to Alt anyway. I'll convince her. Don't fuck this up, Johnny. It's the one thing I can't do for Said you. Said I'd do it, and I will. So summing up, we fly to Arasaka Tower unnoticed and say hello with a welcome basket of missiles. Exactly. Then we jump in, Find the building's vertical axis and work our way down. To the Makoshi access point. Yep. What'd you think? Plan's got more gaping holes than a Kabuki dollhouse. But fuck it, it's gotta work. It won't be the stupidest stunt we've ever pulled. Rogue? What? Just... thank you. Thank me later. There's still the matter of all. Do you know how to move around cyberspace? Well, V got some practice under her belt. Sure, I'll manage. Head out back. Nix will show you the ropes. And you, Wayland, heat up the strings. We'll be with you soon. How long you gonna be? Might I have time for a nap? <laughs> Hey, so you the one gonna dive, right? That is the plan. Right on. Hop into a suit, then have a seat over there. I'm finishing up for the day, so you be resurfacing on your own. And don't fuck with my gear. I told you. 
Alt Cunningham is no more. That's so? Then why do I see her in front of me? You see Alt because you wish to. It's a defense mechanism. Your explicit memory is simply creating a replacement image. It's weird. Like Having I... a bad dream. You read my thoughts? An oversimplification. You still deny what you are. A construct. A set of data. I... know you. You... know me. Like lines of code. Well, this is all completely fucked. Now I feel... Naked. Time is short. Netwatch can detect our local net traffic. How much you know about satellites? Did you Got mention one 0401? I can manage it. Holy fuck, you're doing it now. You're reading I my... I agree with the plan. It will get you inside Arasaka Tower. C can you just hold on a second? You will breach Arasaka Tower, and locate the port into Mikoshi. This is the program that will establish the link. I will send it with you on a splinter. Upon your opening of a back door, I will be able to circumvent the data fort's security protocols. And once that's done... You will be separated from V, and Mikoshi will cease to exist. Cease to exist, as will the constructs inside, right? No. The data constructs will not be destroyed. They will become part of something greater. Nope. Keep trying. Don't understand. Because it is not something you can understand. Fine. Have it your way. Is that everything? That's all that crossed my mind. See you in Mikoshi. Yes. Yes. Right. Works with Asukaga and Finch. Yeah, everything's fine. Got no reason to worry. Now, pull over. Kill the engine and have a nice long look at the stars. Simply that. You won't regret it. Gotta go. I love you. Ready? Alrighty, that looks like a good place to stop. Make sure to hit the like button, make sure to subscribe button. I'll see you guys next video.